was the verdict on, on how that test played out for South Africa? Oh, I think it was obviously a tough test for us. I think a lot of learnings can, can be taken from how they batted. I think they absorbed a lot of pressure on the first two sessions, I'd say, and then gave it back to us in the later periods when our guys were maybe a bit tired. Um, so then for us to maybe get 165 or 180 odd in the first innings was a massive downer, obviously. Um, and yeah, I'd, I don't want to look on the negative side because we still have another test to play and hopefully win. So I think hopefully just we can take a lot of learnings from, from this experience because it's a lot of our first test slash first couple tests. So I think if we can learn and improve going into the next test, I think that that will be a good thing for us here. Yeah. You provided a welcome cameo uh, in the second innings there. Um, tell us what your mindset was. You thought you'd just, just give it a crack or um, you'd take on New Zealand attack? Well, I think I think like a week ago, we actually because we thought uh, Wagner would play, so we thought that we were expecting this tactic at some stage. So we were at I think Lincoln, and we had like an hour session where all our batters had like a method um, of how they wanted to go about it. Um, and my method was that one. And then um, in that first over, I think Matt Henry bowled, and I was blocking and feeling like quite uncomfortable and I just said well I've practiced it so I may as well go and if it works out it works out um, but I feel it's quite gutsy because if you get out like that early you almost it won't look great but I just said it's fine I'll just take it on the chin and I'm glad it worked for an extended period of time but obviously quite disappointed in the way I went out as well. And perhaps how do you feel like the, the side you know obviously an experienced South African side Gelled and bonded together uh, in the circumstances that have been presented? No, I think so. Uh, we had like the same squad playing against the West Indies A side maybe um, I think in November. Um, so, so I think we all know each other quite, quite well. Um, obviously, this is a step up from the A series. Um, and I'm sure we'll learn, learn a lot from how they bowled and how they batted. And going forward into the next test, hopefully, we can come back stronger. Kyle Jameson a different threat with the short ball than the other day? Well, I think so. Um, I think all similar ish speeds, maybe Kyle maybe a bit quicker, um, but his bounce is probably the deciding factor. And I think uh, with Henry and uh, Salvi, I was trying to maybe hit them a bit straighter because it's less bounce. And looking back at it, I mean, hindsight is a nice thing, but looking back at it, I probably should have maybe gone with it a bit more and aimed for like fine leg rather than. Uh, square leg, yeah. Any other further questions? No, that's right. Thank Thanks you very much. Oh, easy. Thanks. Thanks.